Hey everybody, this is Rita Reed. Welcome to Purpose with Rita. So I just wanted to stop in today and just give you a little bit of encouragement. And I just want to say that know who you are. Know the gifts and the talents that you bring to the table. Know your worth. You may be around negative people, whether it be a spouse, whether it be your children, whether it be your mother, your father, your siblings, your co-workers, a boss, whoever that is. Don't let people tear you down and make you think that you are less than who you are. I had a conversation with a good friend of mine today and she was dealing with um, someone making her feel less than and she felt... Um, a little disrespected by it. And what I shared with her was, it doesn't matter what they think about you. What really matters is what you think about yourself. You have to know your worth. You have to know what you bring to the table. Don't let people tear you down and make you feel like you're less than or that the gifts and the talents that you bring to the table is beneath them or that it um, doesn't matter or that it's not relevant to whatever it is that that conversation is. You have to know who you are. And you cannot allow outside influences to come in and tear you down. You understand what I'm saying? You have to say to yourself every day that I am great because I have greatness inside of me and that I can do all things because I know who I am and I know what I bring. You have to walk and stand in your strength. You have to walk in your purpose and you have to stand knowing who you are. So there's always going to be negative people in the world. There's always going to be mean people. There's always going to be haters. And like I said to you in my last video, you cannot control what other people say and do. All you can do is control how you react to that. So I say that to say everything doesn't even require a reaction, at least not a blatant reaction where you have to say something to them because all things don't need to be said. Don't give people that kind of power over you to allow them to have that much influence in your life. You control that. Don't give them people that kind of that kind of influence in your life. Don't let them tear you down. Don't let them make you react. Don't let them make you go off on them and come down to their level and feel like you got to prove to them who you are and you got to tell them, no, I do. I got this degree and I know how to do this and I know how to do that. Don't do that. You know how much energy how much energy that takes out of you to to have to respond to that type of negativity? No. The best revenge is success. Move on in your purpose and continue to do what you're doing because when people are negative with you, that's your fuel to continue to move forward in what it is that you're already doing because apparently you're relevant in their life because they're talking about you. If people are taking that much time to kind of do all that and tear you down, that in itself should let you know that you are already on top of the world because people are taking time out of their day to sit up and talk about you or to sit up and try to belittle you or down you, whether they're downing you to your face or whether they're downing you behind your back. There is no strength in downing anyone. You should be building that person up. That's what gives you strength. When you can tell another individual that you are beautiful, that you are talented, that I see greatness in you, that's a strength. Tearing somebody down, that's not no strength. Trying to make somebody build yourself up by putting somebody else down. That is not any strength, boo. So I just want to encourage you today that and say, you are great. Don't let nobody tear you down. <laughs> and the main thing I want to say is nobody else's opinion of you matters. Their opinion of you doesn't matter. Look at yourself in the mirror and tell yourself the things that you need to hear. You don't have to wait to hear from nobody else. Tell it to yourself. Have you ever heard that song, you got to encourage yourself? Encourage yourself daily. When you wake up, look in the mirror and say, great things are going to happen for me today. Doors are going to open. Doors are going to open. You're gonna, people are going to be put in your life to help you to grow and to succeed in whatever it is, excuse me, that you want to do. But you have to know your worth. You have to know what you can do. And you have to be ready to, to, to do it. 
When people try to shut you down, that's even more of a reason for you to get back up and say, you know what? <laughs> you thought I couldn't do it. Let me show you. So I just want to come on here for like five minutes because I had that happen to me today and I was just a little taken aback by it because I don't like when people mistreat people. I don't like when people talk down to people. And so for me, I just, like I said, I just want to encourage you just to let you know, you don't have to deal with that. What people say about you is a non-factor. At the end of the day, it's more so what you say about yourself. So as long as you keep pumping yourself up and keep encouraging yourself, if nobody else does, you got to do it for you. Do it for you. Know who you are. Know what you bring. Know your strength. Walk in your strength. Walk in your power. And don't give nobody else that kind of power over you. So know your purpose. Purpose with Rita. So I just hope that today that you are gravitating towards your goals and that you are prospering toward that thing that you want to do. Write some goals down. Make every day, <clears throat> make one step every day toward that goal. It's not a race. It's individual growth. It's individual growth, being greater than you was yesterday. So my prayer on today is that you guys are greater than you were yesterday. And if you haven't done something, you still got time. It's 24 hours in a day. Make use of your time because time waits for no man. So until next time, Purpose with Rita. Peace.